This is just a short video on how to use Medibank Paint. Um, the, uh, the device I use is a Samsung Tab E. I'm not sure how many inches the screen is, but it's, it's pretty, de it's decent. Um, so let's get into the application. The application is actually quite small to download. It's a free download. I think it's about, um, if I'm not, um, if I'm correct, it's about 20 MB, 24 MB. Um, so this is what the interface looks like. We're going to start by making a new canvas. So basically, you can edit the size of your can the size of your canvas. Um, what I normally use for Instagram is one four four zero by one four four zero. It's basically the square. Um, it it you you don't have to crop this. It's just a square. Um, that I you use. Um, I use pixels. Don't forget, I use pixels, not centimeters. My DPI is always on 600. And um, background color, you can either use clear or color specifications. You can choose whatever color you want, but I use white. Okay, let's create our canvas. So um, this is the basic interface once you create your canvas. This is your canvas. You can zoom in and out using two fingers, the basic zooming in and out using um, the pinching technique. <laughs> I don't know if that's a technique, but yes, you can use that. And um, right to your left, your far left, this is um, where you can choose your colors those who prefer to use um, this method of choosing colors. I use it most of the times because it's actually quite fast. Um, you've got your pencil, you've got your rubber, your square tool, um, your selections. Um, this is shape tool, yeah. Um, filling in that bucket, the fill in bucket, gradient tool, selections again and then um this is just a grid a grid that people who make comics use but i'm not yet there um your selection tool and fonts okay so let's begin um right to your right there is um this diamond shape those are your layers so if you've ever used photoshop um, you'll be um, quite accustomed to this. Um, to the left of the, 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 the little box at the bottom, there's a plus sign. Um, you can add another color layer, one bit layer, eight bit layer, a folder, um, or select an image. So we're going to select an image of a sketch I did. So it takes you straight to your gallery. Once you're in your gallery, you select the, I'm gonna select the sketch. So you can resize it. You can change the angles as you want, but um, obviously mine was already there. Let me just resize it and set. So it gives you an option to extract line or not. I usually don't like extracting the line because um, it looks like this. So I selected. If you then choose that you actually want to extract the line, you can go to the right side of that little box in the layers with the three dots. And you can say line art. So, um, so you can choose either from one option one, option two, or option three. Or if none of them actually um, fit your taste, 
you can choose the one that's closest and then tweak it to whatever you want it to be okay so I'm going to add another and this is going to be my background layer so let me name it to background so I'm going to use the gradient layer I'm going to and here oh here is your colors and your brushes so once you get in you have um, a few brushes I think they give you six brushes and then um, if you're connected to Wi-Fi or any um, internet connection you can download using this plus and you go to the cloud okay so here we're going to um, create a so using these two boxes it's almost like the paint tool I'm going to select my gradient so here we go and then I'm going to drag it like this I want something like this okay so here I'm going to click back on my 